my name is Keely. I am a museum educator here at the Creative Discovery Museum. And today I'm gonna to teach you guys how to make pom-poms. This is a quick, simple, easy project. We only need two things. We need some yarn, I have three different colors, and we need a pair of scissors. Now, if you've been to the Creative Discovery Museum, you know we have this fancy little tool to make pom-poms, but since you don't probably have that at home, I'm gonna teach you how to do it with just our hands. So you choose which color yarn you want, and we're gonna hold it between our fingers, and we're gonna wrap gently around our four fingers. If you do it too tight, it's gonna start to hurt your fingers. So remember to wrap it loosely. The more we wrap, the fluffier our pom-pom is gonna be. I like to make really fluffy pom-poms, so I'm gonna wrap a whole lot of yarn. When you've decided that you have enough yarn on your fingers and that your pom-pom's gonna be fluffy enough, you're gonna just hold it like that and we're gonna cut, but then we also need to cut a small piece of string to tie around the middle. So we are gonna slide this right off of our fingers. We are gonna take our second piece of string that we have, and we're gonna tie it around the middle really, really tight. We wanna make a really good knot so that it holds all of our yarn together. Now, for us to finish this and turn it into a pom-pom, we have to cut our loops. So that's where the scissors come into play. We can slide them right through the loops, just like that. And we gotta do that on both sides, guys. And then we just fluff it out. And now we have a pom-pom. Now you can get really fancy with yours and you can trim it up to make it a perfect round looking shape. We can use these for all different kinds of crafts. You can even just tie these extra loop around and make it like a little keychain. But there it is, plain and simple. You could do these different sizes. You could even try wrapping around just two fingers to make it a really small pom-pom. You could add multiple colors by holding on two ends of the string and wrapping like that. Then you'd have a multicolored pom-pom. But that's how we make pom-poms. Really quick, really easy. And I hope you guys try this at home. Bye.